When I first saw the thumbnail of this video, I wasn't going to click on it. The title was 7 Ways to Maximize Misery. Why the hell would anyone want to know how to maximize misery? I was going to click on something else when I noticed it had over 9 million views. Then I had to see why everyone's watching it. First, stay still. Remain indoors as much as possible, preferably in the same room. Be the human equivalent of a pile of laundry. Inert unmoving. Don't let a beautiful day tempt you for a walk. Avoid anything even vaguely exercisial. This keeps reward chemicals out of your brain which could divert you, and stillness guides you towards medical problems which will keep this wheel turning. Stillness is the most effective thing you can do. So be the laundry pile. Make your bedroom your all room. Live and work and play and sleep in the smallest radius you can. I soon realized that it uses sarcastic humor to tell you exactly what not to do. Reverse psychology. The comment section is filled with people who say this video helped them more than any other video that tells them how to be happy. Maximize your screen time. Staying on screen complements the previous sailing tactics. Boredom could drive you to motion, so let the screen entertain you. Tiredness can push you to sleep, so let the screen keep you awake, sort of, as long as possible. Always fall asleep with a screen in your hand and put your eyes back on it as soon as you wake. Every moment away from a screen is a moment you might notice the horizon. Keep your head down and let the currents pull you. Here you have allies unknown. Behind the screen are teams of the smartest people and brightest bots competing to hold your attention on them as long as possible. Let them reach you to pull you back if you turn away. Watching this made me realize I should go for more walks and spend less screen time. This video is so brilliant and effective that it makes me wonder if reverse psychology is the way to go for making these advice videos. Nobody likes being told what to do, especially when it comes to self-help topics. We need more videos like these. Here's the link to the full video. Check it out.